Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and if you are new, welcome. In this video, I'm going to show you how I created this beautiful spring inspired set. I love it. I hope you like it too. So keep on watching. Okay guys, okay guys, I already have a thin layer of light salmon. Um, on my nail bed. Um, this was from the previous set that I've done. If you didn't see that video, how I recreate my first ever nail design, I will link it in the description box below. And I've pushed the cuticles back and now I'm filing um, on the cuticle area to make sure um, I've got rid of all the excess cuticles. I'm doing this with a sanding band. Next, I'm cutting off the excess cuticle with a cuticle scissor, but you have to make sure to be very careful when you are doing this step because you can easily cut your client or cut yourself. So guys, be very careful when you're doing this. Now I'm applying two coats of my Super Bound. Okay guys, so now I'm applying a little bit of our light salmon on the cuticle area and a little bit on spots that needed some more. Um, but make sure you don't make your nail beds too thick because at the end we are going to encapsulate the whole nail with a clear acrylic. Okay guys, so this is how the nails look so far. I'm showing you the side view so you can see that I did not make the nails too thick. Okay you guys, so now I'm using the Cakes Ink Nails Nail Forms. Uh, as you all know, I'm not the best with using nail forms. I really love my nail tips, but I wanted the nails a little bit longer than the tips that I had. So I made it work and I really like these tips because, uh, I mean these forms. So now I'm using clear to form the tips and I'm not gonna lie you guys, <laughs> I really struggled to do this on myself and filming it. The acrylic wasn't staying in place, it was running on the sides as you can see, but guys I made it work. <laughs>
as you can see I'm also encapsulating the nail bed with clear acrylic. And this is how they look after getting the forms off. Now I'm going to file the nails down with my medium grit bit um, and after that I'm going to use my hand file to shape the nails. guys so this is how the nails look so far um, now I'm using the cake ink nails um, Easter spring set um, transfer foil set um, to apply them to the nails I'm using her transfer foil gel 
Um, but first you have to cut pieces out of transfer foils. The pieces that we want. I just random cut some butterflies out to apply on the nail. Um, and now I'm applying the transfer foil gel. And after that I'm curing it for like 60 seconds under my lamp. Um, and after that I'm applying the transfer foils or the butterflies to the nail. Okay you guys, so now I'm using some tweezers to place the forms where I want them to be and after that I'm really pressing it into the gel and make sure you have every spot of the foil pressed on your nail because otherwise some pieces won't stick to the gel so make sure you have every little spot pressed in the, in the uh, gel and after that you can get the excess foil off with your tweezers. And last, I'm using the Cakes in Knills gel top coat. I will link everything that I've used from Cakes in Knills in the description box below. And yes, you guys, I also have a coupon code for you guys. I will also link that in the description box below so you can save some coins. Yes, girl, <laughs> I got you. <laughs> When I'm doing clear nails, I always like to apply a thin layer of the gel also underneath the nails. And then you can cure the nails under your lamp and you guys, this is the final result. These nails came out bomb.com. <laughs> I really like them, I am in love with these nails. I hope you like them too and I hope you're doing good in these difficult times you guys. Stay safe, stay home and yeah, these are the final results. So yeah guys, this is the end of the video. I really hope you've liked it, enjoyed it. I hope you have learned something. Don't forget to give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe and don't forget to push on the notification bell. So the next time when I post a video, you're the first to know girl. You're the first to know. And till next time, bye bye.